brisky boys. Oh, a little bit of brisky in Kodiak. Damn, it's frosty as a out here, boy. Holy moly, it's cold. Good place, man. Got this here for the ducks. What do you think, boys? Ready to roll. Right now we're in Kodiak, jumping down to Old Harbor, getting on the boats. We're gonna go deer hunting. Today, I think I'm uh, most thankful for the ability to wet a line, catch a, a bunch of fish in about seven minutes, and in under an hour of eating that. And, uh, that's all I got for you. Amen to being able to wet a line and eat what we fish for within the hour. And as you can see from what's going on behind me, Alaska is a beautiful, beautiful place to be. What's your plan? We're just packing up. Gonna hop on the little boat here. Going three different groups. There's a big piece of shore right here. And uh just gonna drop two, two, and two. We're gonna go shoot some deer this morning. The weather's looking excellent, clear, which is unusual for Kodiak. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna jump up there and shoot uh, what four, four, four deer, four, deer, five deer, four, five four. deer. Yeah, something like that. Maybe maybe one. But uh, sounds like everyone's going deer hunting on Kodiak for the first time in their lives. We're all just a little bit excited. What do you think, Chris? I'm excited. First time on Kodiak. Get ready to get some deer on the ground and stay away from the bears. Kodiak sunrise. Two dudes, two hunters, five tags. Day one. Boat right in. Mostly dry. Mostly. Mostly dry. I have Chris and I. Just got dropped off on the island. We've seen our first deer so far. And uh, we're about to hike up and start a epic adventure hunting sick of blacktails on Kodiak. I think it's time to go. Morning one. We got Jordy in the skiff and we're gonna hit the beach here in about 20 minutes. First buck that we see he's gonna get the hammer. Hammer. Yeah. Uh, 
Georgie's taking off. We're gonna run up this little bluff and get to glassing. Day one energy is good, so. You want to shoot off tripod? I'm pretty solid. Here. Okay. Ready? I am. Hit him. Shoulder. First Kodiak Blacktail. First Kodiak Blacktail. That's awesome. Nice big, big old cape on it. <laughs> Beautiful animals. See, he's on the glass. He stood up. He's looking at something. It's a good spot, buddy. So we got. There's a shot right there. Those guys shot. So right there, there's a big buck right there. Just stood up. CB's on the glass. We got about. I think we were spotted probably 10 deer this morning. This is the third buck. Well, it's our first morning on Kodiak, and it's been eventful so far. We've classed up a ton of deer. I found this nice little four x four here. Looked like a good frame to me, so I shot him and. As we're taking pictures of him, this fox came up and uh, we jumped up. And, oh, there's a shot. Sounds like Bergman's group got one. Um, but we jumped up to to get the gun and uh, he spooked off and lip squeak came right back in. But it's a big fox. And uh, Chris is still glassing up deer. I'm about to take care of these two and uh, figure out what the game plan is next. But it's just so far just an awesome place. <laughs> what just happened, dog? <laughs> that motherfucker dropped dead in his tracks, homie. <laughs> Alaska 2021 the on the board, baby. Thump. Thump them. Woo! <laughs> We're doing pretty good over here. Josh and Jaime. Are, Josh and Jaime are just over the ridge over here. And uh, heard them shoot. Josh got a bow, so pretty sure it's Jaime. But uh, CB's making his way up this little, next little knoll. He got really close. I thought we were going to get that buck, but he just was rubbing the doe. So we're going to go up this little ridge and see if we can see back down where he went to, chasing that doe. It's a good buck. Beautiful morning. It's just it's pretty incredible. Just the emptiness, the vastness, the hugeness. Game rich. 
Just perfect. Damn. Nice black, bro. <laughs> you know what this means, Josh? I know what I was a part of, dog. <laughs> I was a part of that fucking slam, Bubba. This is the slam of deer. Oh yeah. my goodness. I didn't even think about that, Jaime. I was thinking about that on the way out here. No, I just witnessed this dude completing his slam right now. Alaska. <clears throat> yeah, we came up that mountain here. It's all freaking deer. I don't know, at least 30 different ones, obviously. We came up over this ride and we saw a freaking grizzly bear. That pretty much put us on our toes. <laughs> Made it happen and we completed the deer slam with my good friend Josh. That's pretty special. So. Come on. Manos. We've been on the mountain for about an hour. We glassed up probably 20 deer. And then we just had a juvenile boar come running by us at about 140 yards. That'll get your blood pumping. Holy shit. He was coming right towards us. He smelled us back there. He stopped right where you sat. Yeah, he, he, he checked our checked our last glassing spot. Wow. <laughs> Welcome to Alaska. Thank you fucking God and do it again. Look his tracks, bud. He's gonna come down to us. Hey. Mm -hmm. Good shooting. I can't even see him. He's dead. He fell right there in his tracks. I heard him pop. I heard a pop. What'd you just do? Uh, Checked off the sick of blacktail. Got uh, up in this basin, got about, what was it, 540 yards? I think 510. 510? Yeah. I'm not gonna lie, I had to give him a warning shot first. I, I benched up, I wasn't set. I got a little punchy. And he came back down and gave me about another, I don't know, 60 or 70 yards. And I settled in and I, I burned him. I dumped him, right? Yeah, dumped him. Yeah. We're on the board. The board is gonna make me up. Love you. I'm proud of you. Dude, CB. It's a great buck. Yeah, he's pretty cool, isn't he? I don't care where the billy goats live. What a wonderful deer. Thank you, Lord Jesus, for this animal. We had to go vertical. Popped him out 510 yards, and you can see right over here, we had to cut this huge canyon. Uh, but we got him. Nice deer. Straight up. Okay. It's uh, round two for Chris and I. I shot my buck this morning and uh, got him all cleaned up, cut the meat off of him, and we're 
climbing the mountain again. Gonna get Chris a buck. Oh, he's moving now. Cryptoid's closest to the, the ravine, 470. Right above the black rocks. Oh, I think you hit him reload. He acted weird, he flinched. You're good for 470. Aim top of his back, middle of his body. Boom, mailed him. Mailed him. Yeah. That's a sweet spot. First buck down. 450, is that what we ranged him at? Yep. First one, a little bit low. Made a little adjustment. Front shoulder, done. Beautiful country. Holy smokes. Let's go get him. Let's go get him. He's done. That is a cool buck. Really cool buck. First blacktail, huh? First blacktail. First deer with Chase Christopher. I don't think it's three hunts. Yeah. <laughs> oh. oh. He's just laying right there. Give me some cool pictures. Trashy on the bottom. Whew. Nice. Pull him up a little bit. <laughs> I think it's cool. I want to shoot yeah. a mountain goat. What? It's a bow. A duck. Look. A duck. You just want to shoot one? A duck. A duck. Quack, 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 quack.
All right, Chase and uh, Josh and Chris are going over there. Josh hasn't killed and I haven't killed, so that's it. We're teaming up, doing three and three. This afternoon we finally can get to shore. The wind's been so crazy, we couldn't, couldn't even get the dinghy off the boat to get to run into shore. Just too big of waves, 50, 60 knots. So now we found a little pocket that's kind of protected. And Jaime and CB and I are gonna run down the beach. We got some deer we think are buck, at least one buck over here we're gonna to try to go see. Try it again. Five mile an hour ocean winds, snow capped mountains, really tall peaks. And, uh, got it done. Had to take care of the weather and let it take care of us. Now we came out today and Frozen boogers here. Um, Wednesday. It's uh, Wednesday. We are here. Gosh, just shot its first. Sick black tail. And uh, we're packing it out. Going deer hunting this morning. Where do we get our buddy Sam here with deer today? Feeling good. The wind so far, knock on wood, way better than yesterday. So it's gonna be a good morning.
touch the ground? Yeah. Yeah. Could like like right, be right below his feet. Right below his head. Like. Where oh, yeah. 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 Do what you did, but a foot left. He's coming down. He's coming oh. down. Oh, 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 Are you videoing that, Chase? Well, I'm gonna f up the elevator. Yeah. <laughs> if something kill him, then f with his neck for sure. I'm a f laws. Got me a blacktail buck. First blacktail? First blacktail. <laughs> Appreciate all these bastards going for a nature walk with me. <laughs> <laughs> took, took a dang village on the, on the last day here. Find our six buck for the trip. Got it. Huh? No horns. No horns. Skinhead. <laughs> he took the, the quick pack out. Kodiak cartwheel. The Kodiak cartwheel. <coughs> Saved us about an hour of hiking though. Dang horns popped off. Broke off. Josh is gonna go look for him. Sam smoked it and he did the uh Kodiak cartwheel <laughs> and about halfway down Jaime says hey man I don't think he has any horns anymore that's one way to get down the hill boy <laughs> Packed up. Sam's buck. I just want y'all to know how it goes down in Kodiak. Six o'clock in the morning on Monday, and our trip is over, and now we're back home. And all the boys behind me made it home safely. And now we're just hoping Jaime makes it home safely, obviously. And unfortunately, another uh, amazing trip's come to an end, and there's the homeboys behind us right there. Yeah.